I have been teaching L3 for more than three years already. Uh, uh, so I was given a, a charge to uh, change the course uh, to uh, make it even better than what is actually done previously in uh, previous years. And uh, we actually made a lot of adjustment uh, uh, during these uh, few years with uh, many other professors uh, in the physics department. Uh, so what we actually did is to change the, uh, the textbook. Uh, the textbook is actually now much more theoretical oriented so that uh, we benefit from uh, that uh, for the preparation for the other course like AO4, which is actually the, the quantum physics, and, uh, and also the other course which are related to waves and vibration. Uh, the benefit is the following. So the students who are, have, are, are equipped with more mathematics uh, background will also uh, find it uh, much more interesting uh, compared to uh, previous years because in the previous years we are uh, mainly focusing on uh, uh, very practical problem solving. Producing uh, more uh, theoretical oriented uh, uh, content um, that can help us to systematically understand single oscillator, coupled oscillator, infinite number of coupled oscillator uh, to work uh, continuous and uh, uh, infinitely coupled system uh, in a very, very well-defined uh, theoretical framework. And uh, finally, I think what we uh, really did is to introduce a lot of demos uh, well, m much more demos actually than uh, previous years so that it goes with the lecture uh, so that uh, uh, the people can actually look at those demos and compare to our theoretical calculations. And uh, I think that is actually uh, evolving as a function of time and we were adding or subtracting the demos which we think is more useful or or less useful during the semester. And uh, that is actually what you see now uh, in the 2016 version.